Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're going to be taking a look at the 25 free items that you can get in Call of Duty Warzone Season 3. There's 25 different items as I just said, but quickly before we do jump into those guys, if you aren't around, be sure to subscribe to the channel, notifications, turn us, don't miss any more videos on the channel. We're at 10k subs, if you can have a set, that'd be absolutely amazing. If you do enjoy the video, please smash thumbs up, let me know your thoughts on Season 3 and all the free content in the comments below. But I'm just going to jump straight into it right now for you guys. So first of all guys, is going to be this Captain Price Operator skill you get when you load into Cold War. If you've got Cold War, it's exclusive to having Cold War. So if you own Cold War, just literally load up the game and you'll be given this free Captain Price skin. Pretty sick skin to be fair with a gas mask on. Obviously, it's Captain Price as well, which makes it even cooler. And then the next items are all in the battle pass, guys. We'll start at the beginning, go through the free items that are there, and we are going to be getting a free emblem, which is pretty sick. It's actually quite a clean emblem, to be fair. Out of all the emblems that are usually in the battle pass, it's probably one of the coolest ones that I've actually seen. Going to get 100 COD points, which if you guys save all the COD points that you get from the battle pass, obviously, you can then buy the next battle pass as well. Uh, obviously, number 14, which is the sick one, is the PPSH. Everyone's gas for this gun. I think it's going to be so overpowered in the game. I'm genuinely excited to start using it in a moment. I will start leveling it up as soon as this video is finished on Twitch. If you want to come and follow me over there, my link will be in the description. So you can come and follow me over there if you want. I'll be streaming all day. I'll be on and off making videos, streaming, making videos, streaming. And uh, next up is this XM4 skin. Again, another pretty cool skin. Pink. It's a bit, got a, color, a bit of color in there. Quite bright. It's got that like chromey pink color on it pretty clean next up is a qbz um gun as well i'd like to take all the guns in this uh, battle pass all the bl blueprints actually look very very nice in this first time we've actually seen a battle pass with loads of clean skins and it usually just black and dark green and you don't even really notice them but this qbz looks pretty cool as well with like this chrome chameleon uh camo on top i don't even know how to say it. it's kind of, kind of looks like a little bit like damascus as well next up you're going to get a, a new reticle it's actually quite a clean reticle to be fair because of the blue dot in the middle which would make that a little bit more accurate next up is going to be the swiss k31 uh, a bit like the car 98k a marksman rifle or a sniper rifle because it's cold war hopefully this is pretty good and a lot of fun to use i'm going to be using this as well as the ppsh in game as you can imagine uh, next up is going to be a new watch which we're going to get which is going to display your level so if you guys always wonder what level you are you can see it quite quite clearly on the map next up's a new uh a new gesture giving it one of them quite like that one it's probably one of the ones i actually have on and one of them i'll actually end up using so when i'm trolling the boys because they're not playing just sat there with one of them going on and then next is going to be a new truck skin in cold war which is pretty clean and it is also then going to give us a new buggy skin in warzone and again another quite a clean um quite clean skin for it which is actually quite a nice change that we're actually getting a lot of good stuff in the battle pass a lot of it's usually quite a bit of fodder and no one really uses it for anything next up is going to be um some war tapes from battle from black ops 3 obviously can't play these because of copyright reasons which is just annoying i can't even play them on twitch when i'm streaming because of dmca rules next up is going to be another 100 cop points again that you can save them to get towards the next battle pass if you guys haven't already got it uh, next up is going to be a blueprint for the uh, M82 I believe it is, again an example of some of the NAF camos we do see, it's just dark, it's just only got some green lines and a bit of sludge on it, again it's a bit cleaner than some of the other stuff that we see because it's got something going on but not something I'll be using personally myself as the gun's not even that great anyway. Next up is going to be another reticle, again another clean reticle, it's not too much going on, it's not too going to take up too much of the site, again a nice clean reticle there. Next up is going to be a zombies calling card which actually is quite cool, it's got the sniper to the right, it's taking someone's a zombie's head off. This actually looks like a cool calling card, which is nice to see. Like I keep saying, it's nice to have a battle pass full of content that's usable and actually looks good on the eye. And then saying that, we do get a rare emblem of whatever this is. I'm not going to be using that. I don't think many people will be using that one. Uh, next up is the 80s pop, the second one that we guys have. If you remember in the last battle pass, we got a load of 80s music, which can go on the helicopters, which can go on the trucks, the berthers, the buggies, etc., etc. And this is um, the second version of that, so there's going to be more songs on there. What have we actually got? Should I stay or should I go? You spin me right round and cities in the dust. Absolute belters coming out of there. Again, another one I just want to point out. This isn't free, but another example of the six skins we are seeing in this battle pass. It's an MP5 skin. It looks super, super clean. Not really something we usually see in the battle pass. We don't really see these cool skins. Uh, next up is going to be another calling card. Again, a nice cartoon artwork. Just the artwork on these calling cards is actually very clean this, this month round or this season, which is actually really, really nice. Next up is going to be a new M82 blueprint. Just a bright orange camo. It looks quite clean. Again, probably not something a lot of people are going to use because there are cooler skins for the M82 out there. Uh, next up is going to be a, 
a, a, a nuclear charm. Obviously, the nuke, the map's been nuked, so you knew there was going to be a nuke coming in there somewhere. Next up is a absolutely fire reticle that I'm probably going to actually end up using. It's got like the blue dot in the middle with the crosshairs on the outside. Super clean, super light. It's not going to take up a lot of the screen at all. You can be very accurate with this. Big fan, a big, big fan of that. And then finally, guys, the last three... Oh, wait, there's two more free things. Don't don't panic. We're now going to 80s pop three because you can't have enough 80s music for the trucks, apparently. Don't you want me? The safety dance and everybody wants to rule the world. And then finally, it is going to be another 100 cob points. And if you guys wondering what the end of the battle pass looks like, we have got this new truck or we've got a Bertha skin with obviously the um, new marksman rifle slash sniper rifle with a PPSH with reactive camos, which is what I was hoping for. I was really hoping we were going to get a PPSH with reactive camos, and that is exactly what we've got. And just look at how sick that is. It's absolutely insane. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, be sure to smash thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts on it in the comments below. If you aren't already subscribed to our channel with notifications turned on, make sure you do do that. Like I said, I'm on road to 10k subs. If you can help us hit that, that would be absolutely amazing. Like I said, if you want to watch me get any of these guns leveled up and being used in Warzone as soon as possible, my link to my Twitch will be in the description with my other social media if you want to follow me anywhere else. I appreciate you watching all the way to the end. Catch you on the next one in a bit. Peace.